All right, so tap my watch. Tap the side. Okay, it's 7.08 in Cairo right now. Um, after we left from the pyramid, we stopped at a jewelry store and not the announcement. Okay, that was a train station announcement. But anyway, we went to the jewelry store and then we went to the papyrus paper store where like the first paper ever made. That was like a museum for that. And so now we're at the train station and we're going to get on the sleeper train to Aswan. So we're just waiting to get on now. in front of us is like a little sink so the same and a trash hey, can hey, hey. and what you doing? obviously a little mirror yeah touching it it's on another like little lunch tray that you're used to from school like it's an old sleeper train and they're doing the best they can the workers are super nice and they're they're very quick in assisting us
you jiggy with this? Mm -hmm. Okay, that's enough. 
in the world? What world? <laughs> Just push the bed together ourselves to make one big bed. But it's a decent cabin. I think everybody is going to get cleaned up, take a shower, and get ready for lunch. I'm definitely ready for a shower. I feel gross.
best color in the world, our color game. and baby boy is away from me and I did one of my sessions and nope got inside of the battery hub and now it's not working and I'm freaking out a little bit because I'm in Egypt um, and we're on the cruise and of course today we leave the port so I was just gonna Amazon um, like a backup pump for myself but we're about to leave so I have nowhere to send it so I'm just freaking out a little bit all the breastfeeding mamas out there like you know why I'm freaking out if this milk backs up I'm gonna have a, cl a clogged duct and it's just not something that you want to have to deal with on vacation and I'm trying to stay positive because my husband is doing everything that he can to try and help me fix it and today is our anniversary um, and we're supposed to be happy <laughs> And he's just showing out right now. Like, I'm so grateful for him. I don't know what I would do if I didn't have him right now in this moment. Because I don't know how to fix this. He's been trying his hardest. So, whatever. I'm not trying to bum you guys out. But this is just how my day has been starting so far. So, we are up super early right now i got up at five to start pumping but it's about four five forty five now and we're about to head off of the boat to go to a hot air balloon which is pretty cool so i'm trying to stay positive especially since my my man is trying to fix it for me but i'll let you guys know what happened We have to take these boats to get to the hot air balloons.
That is funny. There you go. Nice. He's been waiting for you to walk up, Mark. He's been waiting for this. In Egypt, we are very, very lucky people. Wow. We here got like 80% working with the stones. And that stone, we got it from the mountains. And we do a copy of the original in the temple and in the tomb. You just look here. All the picture, what you just saw in the tomb, here. We've got the professional artist, the star doing the hand cars. See, great relief and deep relief. All the kings and the queens, Francis, Horace, Anubis, and we've got so much. And by the way, if we're gonna ask about the name, you're gonna be very surprised. What's your Picasso. name? Picasso. Oh my God! Picasso. Picasso. Picasso! Let's see the second guy. He's doing the great. I'm a question, who is he? Oh, you're right! Wow. Okay! That's for you! Oh. Not because you say Anubis, because you're a nice dancer. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, don't be jealous, my brother. <laughs> Two million camels! That's the Anubis! Anubis! Ooh. Super hot out here. But. We did some shopping to make us feel better after not getting on the hot air balloon. It didn't make up for it, but it made us feel a little bit better. But now it's time for us to get back on our cruise ship.
Good morning, you guys. Wayne wasn't feeling too good this morning. So it's just me uh, with the rest of the group today. So prayers that his stomach feels a little bit better, but I think he ate something wrong. Um, but we, our, tra our only transportation in the city that we're in now is by horse and buggy. I'm not gonna lie, it kind of makes me a little bit sad because the horses look kind of skinny, like you can see the ribs of them. And so I'm really just hoping and praying that they're not abused. Um, and that they're taken care of. Um, we are in Aswan today. So let's go uh, explore Aswan. back from the Edfu Temple. That's where we were today for our first excursion. Um, and we're getting ready to leave the port. I think it is getting pretty close to lunchtime. I'm gonna go check on Dwayne just to make sure that he feels a little bit better for the stomach and everything. And uh, probably go out to the pool for the rest of the day. All right, got another pump session right now. Um, and then we're finally at um, the second port. Take it off the boat in Aswan. I have a, uh, a temple to go to again. Um, and then actually, I'm not even sure what we're supposed to do after the temple, but I guess we'll find out together. Most of our group was down at the pool. I came back to the room with Dwayne and took the best nap in the world. So I feel a lot better. My body is a little bit sore from this bed just because it's it's kind of firm. Um, but let's go to our last temple of the day. getting ready to get on the bus to make a three-hour ride um, further into Aswan for another temple tour. So, Miguel's downstairs waiting in the lobby. Well, almost everybody. But, I don't know if this is the final temple or not, but I think it is the final temple. But down further into Aswan, there's like some Americanized food, and I'm not gonna lie, I appreciate the culture and the Egyptian food, but I'm ready to have like a slice of pizza. <laughs> so let's go.
sleep over here in Essie. This is where they got crocodiles in their house. Oh, hell no. Yeah, it's cold in here. It's a nice bathroom. I'm gonna 
It's been a very long day, you guys. I didn't even vlog a whole lot today. We'll have our breakfast in the morning when you're ready. Yeah, let's do that. Um, today we were kind of lazy and didn't do much of anything. Um, we had lunch at McDonald's today. We did some shopping at the oil bar and got a whole lot of essential oils and um, lotion. We got on a flight from Aswan to Cairo and now we're in Cairo. It's like 1.30 in the morning and we just checked into our hotel um, and about to try and find some food and get ready for bed. Tomorrow is going to be another lounge day and I think everybody is super excited to be somewhere that's like high class. <laughs> like somewhere that is a little like just not outdated. Yeah, we roughed it a little once. more on this trip than normal. Yeah. Normally we have a couple of days where we kind of rough it or whatever. Most of it. And we just had a couple of luxury days. But I guess it's nice to start and end it that way at least. Yeah. But this is by far the best place we've stayed so far. So, I'm going to find some food, get in the shower, and get ready for what I feel like is actual vacation. <laughs> Our room service is here. It feels really hot. Ooh, pizza looks good. In your fish. Not terrible. I have some red pepper flakes that could help. Hot sauce. Tomato ketchup. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look at the powder. Mayonnaise. <laughs> it looks good though. So we're at the, how do you pronounce this, Sofintel? Yes. Hotel? Yeah, Sofintel? This place is high class. They have the best food that like I've had in Egypt so far. I'm really excited about my food. I mean, I haven't tried the burger yet, but the fish last night was good. The fries are fresh. It actually comes with real ketchup and mayo. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, so far I'd give this place like 10 out of 10. We should have been here the whole time. I'm in love. Cool day. I think everybody else like got up at the crack of dawn to go to the pool, but Dwayne and I took advantage of a, a soft bed finally. Like, we... Oh, this is not it. Anyway, we slept in. We took advantage of a soft bed for the first time in like over a week. So we're just now going to the pool. I think it's like noon. Is that right? Yes. So that's what we're going to be all day. 